All right, so the last leg of our road trip has us driving from Bintulu to Miri, and we're making one pit stop at what is being called a modern longhouse. So not sure what to expect, but pretty excited for this because we've seen quite a few longhouses on our road trip and on our Borneo journey, but nothing like this. So from the outside, it sort of looks like a mall. I could imagine one end having a food court and maybe a 7-Eleven and a hair salon and some convenience stores, but believe it or not, it is a longhouse. Now, we've learned that we're supposed to bring gifts. It's customary to bring gifts to longhouse because the chief has allowed us uh, access granted to come inside. Um, so we're not sure what to bring, although we brought some alarms. We brought some uh, fruits, dragon fruits and bananas. Hopefully this will be a passable gift. Anyway, with all that being said, let's go inside and see what we can see in the modern longhouse. Excited for this. Oh wow, guys, check this out. <laughs> Very nice. So special thanks to our host today, Sukarno and um, Madame Sedi. Yeah. Madame Sedi. Thanks for bringing us today. All right, so first impressions of a modern longhouse. Naturally, it is very long. I asked Barapa Pintu, which is how many doors, meaning how many families live here, and it's 32. So there are 32 families living in this modern longhouse and you might expect what stands out to me is just how modern it is because the tile work is amazing and evidently in each room there's air conditioning but in fact what stands out to me is it's so quiet and there's nobody here because our experience in the longhouses has been it's always lots of people around lots of people to talk to they're curious they're engaging and it's sort of a very community atmosphere so my first impression is wow this is like a quiet uh, longhouse. The quietest longhouse we've been to so far. All the, all the longhouse folk here, they all work at their farm at the back of their longhouse. So oh. these people uh, all depend on their, this one, oil pump. This one. Oh. So the, the, during the daytime, the longhouse is empty, but there are people in the longhouse during the evening time. I see. After they come back, the, this longhouse is full of uh, Poor people. Poor people. Right, right. So now they're working at the working oil palm oil palms, farm. At their garden, people garden. Right. Thank you. <laughs> nice one. Are you on the Okay. All right. So it seems the chief is a little bit more busy than we expected. So we are going to venture around the back of the longhouse. Now, to be clear, we are with a local who's very familiar with this place and we are not sneaking around without the chief. What I didn't realize, though, is there's a second floor in this longhouse. Mm -hmm. So it really is a modern longhouse. Everyone's got a brand new car out front. There's a couple of chickens and a couple of small farms out front. But more or less, this is a almost like a townhouse in Canada. Yes, where everyone you're right. has their own house. It's just a townhouse with you're a right. connected lobby in front of the house. Yeah, that's a So it's very lobby. modern and sort of familiar to us. <laughs> really nice experience. This is our third or fourth longhouse we've been to. Maybe and more. Totally unique. Maybe more. Yeah. And totally unique. Uh, let's go check out the backyard. Wow, check it out, guys. The backyard really shows you the vastness and the sheer size of the longhouse. So everyone's got a back gate that I think you can drive your car right in. And then inside, there's a sort of under the roof, half indoor backyard, which leads into the longhouse. And I guess it sort of makes sense that nobody's around in the modern longhouse, because everything is very big and brand new and expensive. And so everybody is at work. Now, to be clear, the people in the tribal longhouses are also very hardworking people. They're just not doing modern jobs where they earn a lot of money. They're doing fishing and farming and stuff like that. But everyone here is more like at a modern job, nine to five. Although, even in a modern longhouse, still some chickens around and some farming happening and some roosters. These chickens are not for makan makan. Okay. Cockfighting chickens. Cockfighting chickens. They make cockfights here. In a modern longhouse. I didn't expect that, Ken. Good info. Good vlogging, buddy. So these are not for McCann McCann. These are big cock fighting chickens. Okay, I didn't expect that. I really didn't expect that. 
but uh, I guess we can journey into someone's backyard here. And again, we're with a local who has asked permission and we are not trespassing by any means. Uh, so this is like a backyard, maybe like an outdoor kitchen, and then a, almost like a garage, and then into the house. The room, dining room. Dining room in there. Yeah. Oh, I see, I see. see wow. <laughs> the, uh, the feeling here is just great. You got the, the audio, you've got uh, the big longhouse. Bit of an adventure and just a good feeling being here. Very, very friendly people. Hello. Hello. Good morning. Good morning. Are these are these your chicken? No. No. It's a uh, toy kampong. Oh, head, kampong chicken. Head of la long house. Oh. Chief. They going out here just now. Oh, the chief is out now. But these are his his chickens. Yeah. Ah, I see. I see. <laughs> okay. Nice to meet you. Okay, check it out guys. We've managed to meet one guy who is inviting us in his house. So this is his backyard. The cockfighting chickens are just over there. And now we're gonna go in. Okay, can come. Maybe uh, remove the shoes. No, no, come, come. It's okay? Just follow me. Okay, okay. I'm the chief. You're the chief today. The chief for today. The chief for a day. Okay, sounds good. Just for a few minutes. Few minutes, okay, okay. My shoes are clean. So this would be like the backyard or like the Sort of dining area. Yes. Dining area. This is the open closet. Open concept backyard. Actually, very similar to the tribal longhouse. It's just all new. Yeah, and but much bigger. Actually. Much bigger and just new, but same kind of arrangement. Fantastic. And I think uh, a welcome drink. Wow. Wow. It's a gift. It's a gift. Yeah. <laughs> joking, joking, joking. <laughs> One go. One go. So let me say thank you very much for having us at the Longhouse. Now welcome, Mr. Thank Stephen. you very much. Thank different you. countries, different thank nationalities, you. different beliefs, but one world, yeah. one people. Okay. Satu Malaysia. Oh. Ready to party. Breakfast of Champions. That's my son's name. Oh, that's amazing. You have the same name. Your son is named Steve. Connected. Yeah. Steve, hold it. Oh! Ha! I should have had more than rice noodles for breakfast. That's why. That's why we have the name. <laughs> oh my goodness! <laughs> they carried this table just for us. Thank you. <laughs> you contact this big boss, Steve. <laughs> he's, he's inviting all of us to his son's wedding and he said we must come. I don't know if you know, but my my wife she's a princess. I know. She is a beautiful princess. I know. Thank you. Oh. Oh. It's like my friend. Yep. Wow. Your people. Yes, my people. All this one is my huh? very generous people. Yeah, very, very generous people. Yeah, very generous. When they see wow. a guest, they, they kind of swarm the guests. Yeah. They want to give and yeah. enjoy and drink and can you, uh, can you remember? Generous with love in the longhouse. Can you remember the I saw uh, in the uh, yeah. you you sit down <laughs> Same. That's two up? You 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 think us. Two up, two up. He filled me up and he said, this is the best one. You must try. So I got to finish and fill again. So, so this one, best one. Then why I want you to test it? Because you are the chief. Oh, this one smells stronger. Nah. I, I honestly we've, can't tell. Oh, he finished in one go. <laughs> Yo, you're the best. Man. I'm going to be like you. <laughs> I am not the best, but I am your friend. Okay. <laughs> because you are... You you come here that you respect me. Mm. I never come to your place. Yeah. That's why in our traditional we have to accept people with our open heart. Mm. Right. 
like this also if you oh thank you when they like accept people with their open heart Hmm. So when you come to Canada, you call me. Canada? We can drink some uh, Canadian whiskey. Oh, I when I went uh, when I come to Canada, I want you to bring me to the ski. Ski. Yeah, ski. Yeah. Yeah. Ah, yeah. Go, very nice. We go out west. We go Vancouver. Can. <laughs> Vancouver. Yes. Can. Skiing trip. All right. Oh, ah. <laughs> Set. But when you come Ooh. to good. No, you don't. But when you come to my place, we can go to the ski. We go. Waterfall jump. Waterfall jump. Okay. No ski. Okay. You know what I'm saying? waterfall jump, Canada ski. Canada ski. Okay. Bumba. <laughs> oh, sealed. Sealed. It's a deal. It's a deal. I just want you all to know I love you all. Okay. Thank you. 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 Thank I feel the love. Wait, wait, oh, wait. Oh, I go, I go the... Oh, everyone's empty, everyone's empty. <laughs> we drink too I slow. Too I drink too slow. Yeah. 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 Alright. Okay. Okay. Here's to the road trip, here's to Sarawak. Wait, wait, wait. Here's to the long house. Ooh, Ooh, look at this. Refill, refill. Oh. Ah, oh, hot. Oh. Oh, hot. Just taking you guys on a tour inside one of the residents house so this is the backyard and the layout of the houses for most of them from the backyard will come into the kitchen here let's see very nice and modern kitchen actually uh-huh i like it yeah you can see we can see ourselves cooking here gigi <laughs> Making pitch, exactly. <laughs> Look at this. And then this is the hangout space where everyone drinks I and eat drink together. To understand. Wow. Let the devil take tomorrow. Oh my gosh, he's such a good Not singer. I need a <laughs> and this is inside the house. Modern house. There are two stories. So first floor and second floor. And this is the house living room. Wow. Very nice house. Wow. Look at this. And inside this house, they have AC and fans. Christmas tree is still there. <laughs> Look at this. It's actually pretty big. It looks like a modern house. Like any other modern house. And then we come out, and this is the hallway where we were earlier today. And this is just the front parking garage. Wow, interesting. This is amazing. And this is just the neighbor. The neighbor's house looks similar to this one. I think all the longhouse have a similar layout. All the houses. Oh. All right. <laughs> Look at this. Very nice. And all the kids actually, you see picture of kids. They're at school right now, so that's why the long house is pretty empty and everyone is at work. And I think it's their bedroom up there. And that's it. Pretty nice house. Pretty nice. Look at this. And they're still partying. <laughs> wow, taking photos. Okay. Ivana, you send to Anthony Dagan and Kenny, okay? Okay, sure, sure, sure. Photo, photo. Okay, photo. Let's go. One, two, three. With sunglasses on. <laughs> you look cool. <laughs> look at this. I can't drop the name, boys. No, no, no. I'm not sure you're all for me. Come on. Okay, hold this one. Wow. Clear. 
Look at the hospitality here, guys. It's amazing. Five stars hospitality. You're right. Six stars, Mona. Six stars. Be real. Be honest. Yes. Thank you. Really. Amazing. Oh, so nice. They're also they're proud of their heritage and culture and their tuak. Woo! Correct. Correct. Now we are found. We were lost before, and now we are found. Correct. Correct. Good. Correct. Okay. So anyway, I'm very thankful to him. Okay. Oh, thank you so much. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. The best guys. You can't beat yeah. it. You really can't beat it. Very nice. It's a different longhouse. It's modern. Yeah, it's but modern. But the spirit of the longhouse is the same. Yes. yes. The spirit of giving is the same. Same. Yeah. Independent same. of the air conditioning and the walls and the yeah. roof. The spirit is the same. Very. Nobody coming, something is happening, and Steve is snoring. Road trip is going very good so far. All right, and just like that, we have made it to Miri, and after a double cheeseburger, as well as three glasses of water, I am feeling much better, and I am back to life. And back to reality. So let us show you our Airbnb for the night, and then we'll let you go. Yo, check it out. Check it out. Welcome to the Lock Yeah, the Yeah. Check it out. We are the best. Dude, nice apartment. Big enough to play baseball in. Shout out to Nickelback. All right, there you have it. Now, guys, important to end the vlog by talking about Tucarno because this man that we met in the Longhouse, oh, I would describe him as so sincere. Yes. At first, it makes you suspicious. <laughs> no. He's so he overwhelmingly was... sincere. For at least five minutes, you got to go, what's happening here? Why is this man so nice? No, he's so And then nice. you get to know him and you realize he's just someone to admire. Someone yeah. to look up to, someone to strive to be. Yeah. Super kind-hearted man, super genuine, super sincere. He almost amazing. made me cry. Ivana was almost in tears in the car. Yeah. So sincere. <laughs> uh, someone to really... Amazing hospitality in Sarawak yes. by uh, the people, the tribal people that lives in a long house. Boom. Wow, they treat you as your own, as their own family. True fact. Yes. You walk in and you feel like family immediately. Yes, mm -hmm. yes. Even Just this, amazing. The guy said, Sukarno said, Steve, you're my son now. Wow. He said, I must come back. And now I just realized I left my hat in the longhouse. <laughs> so so now I must come, come back. back. So <laughs> Sarawak, we'll see you next year when we come back for our uh, longhouse yeah. part two, long as house. well as redemption of my hat. Very different than the other longhouse we have visited before. Very modern. This but, could be inside the But longhouse. even a different, but the same in spirit. Mm -hmm. The same in spirit. Yes. The people course. were the same, the friendliness, the outgoing, the hey you, come over here, let's have a drink. Yes. The, the conversation, of same, course. same, Just same. The layout is more modern, it's more luxurious. Just like any other house, but it's right beside one another yeah. with a big hallway in the front boom and the all right yard, the backyard is like wow cock amazing. fighting chickens amazing. in the back all right there you have it guys oh, we will see you in the next movie. one and thanks for watching which is later skaters empty empty room spare room yes best oh, wow. twin wow. beds yeah. oh look at this one Yo, who am I, Bill Gates? This is the nicest place I ever stayed. <laughs> Shout out to us. This is the benefits of traveling with four people. Later, everybody.